Hi, my name is Larry Thompson. I am the district engineer for the Kansas Department of Transportation in the southwest corner of Kansas. I'd like to visit with you for a few moments about some of the projects, the highway preservation and bridge preservation projects that we have scheduled for work this summer in District 6 in the southwest corner of Kansas. I'd like to start on US 54 in Meade County. This is actually a project that was last year's project that didn't get completed due to the cold weather. The contractor is out around Fowler on US 54 and will start in the first week of April and should finish about the first week in May at the county line with Clark County. Then beginning at the Clark County line west of Mineola on US 54 through Mineola into Ford County through Buckland and to the east Ford County line there's a project on US 54. We have a project on US 56 in Gray County. It starts at the county line west of Copeland and goes east through Copeland, east through Montezuma and to the east city limits of Enzyme. We have a project on US 50 in the Hamilton and Kearney County that starts at Syracuse and ends at Lakin. One additional highway preservation project is on K25 north of the city of Leota. It actually starts in Leota and goes north past Caprock Feeders to the county line. Now all of these projects will involve traffic control using pilot cars to carry the traffic through construction and around the actual work zone. So there will be flaggers in the road, there will be pilot car lines, and you should expect 15 to 20 minute delays depending on when you arrive at the pilot car line. Also in Leota on K25 and on K96 there is a project requested by the city that involves curb and gutter repair and storm sewer repair on both of those highways. The traffic control in that case will be done with signs and cones just to guide you safely around that construction. We have a couple of bridge projects that will be under construction this summer. One is on US 56 over the Cimarron River way down in the southwest corner of Haskell County. There will be some bridge repair and a polymer bridge deck overlay to seal the water out of that deck. The other project is on US 54 east of Liberal out at the Arcalan rest area. It will involve some bridge repair and a polymer deck seal to seal the water out of that deck. Traffic control on those bridge projects will be with traffic lights and one-way traffic across the bridge. KDOT and the contractor both recognize that these projects cause you delays in your daily work in southwest Kansas. And we appreciate your willingness to cooperate and to pass safely through those work zones. The goal of our effort here is to get the work done safely, efficiently, quickly, and so that everybody goes home safely at the end of the day. I would invite you to look at our T-Works and Facebook pages on the web at ksdot.org. If you are doing, if you are sitting in your vehicle behind the steering wheel and it is moving and you are doing anything other than driving, please stop. Driving is a full-time job. We have to give our full attention, especially when we are around work zones and people working in the road. Thank you. Have a great summer. Be safe.